Modern Labs here, guys. This is the firebox from an old diesel-fired uh, furnace. Um, I replaced an air conditioner in a gentleman's house uh, a few weeks ago, and he had a diesel furnace. And upon taking it apart, I seen that this was how they had the firebox set up. So what came to mind was a new rocket mass heater. Uh, basically what this was, was a big rectangular box. In this back section here, all in through here, there was a, uh, a uh, blower motor and a squirrel cage with a blower. And then here on the front, they had the, uh, the oil pump and blower would connect here. Um, well, not the oil pump, the diesel pump. And it would pump the diesel gas into here, light the diesel fuel, go inside the, uh, the burn chamber here. And, you know, the burn chamber would get hot. The exhaust gases would come out through the top here and then go out the flue to the house. And then the blower would draw the air in across uh, this big square box here on top. And that's what they used to heat their house. So I took this whole thing apart and I found down on the inside here that this is all lined with fire brick. So it's nice and insulated here. So my thought was to turn this into a rocket stove, rocket mass heater. So I took it all apart, cleaned it up, and basically what I'm going to do here, the base, I'm going to cut off here where it's kind of discolored, and I'm going to use the old pieces that were around it. This is really heavy gauge steel, so that'll be nice for the, uh, the outside of it. I'll just have to cut and reform some of it to make it into a square, and, uh, and that'll be the basic platform for the, the new heater. Okay, now for the design of the firebox, if you see here on the simple one I made with the barrel and uh, some uh, ductwork and stuff, the, the firebox here, you know, just goes down and in. And being as this, I made this bigger than the previous video so I could put more fuel in, but what I noticed is with this being a lot bigger, I would have problems with uh, keeping a draft going sometimes. So once I get the fire lit and going, you know, I'd set these pieces of metal here and that would choke off, you know, some of the air coming in so I could keep a good draft going. On this design here, if you see the front there on the bottom, that's going to be where the firebox is going to attach to. And here in a little drawing, that corresponds to this little deal here. So, the firebox is going to be made out of quarter inch steel. Uh, this will be the lid where I open to put fuel into it. It's going to be glass, so I can see what's going on. And the air intake will be on either side, one here and on the back side of this. And the air inlet holes will be here on the top, which will correspond here on the top. I'll drill holes in here. And then I'm going to have, right below those holes, will be some heat sink fins, maybe out of some eighth inch steel or maybe something a little bit smaller. And then the air will come in the bottom, go across these fins, get preheated, and come in the holes on the top and then go down and then go into the hole here come up the burn chamber heat the burn chamber come out the top heat the box around the outside which will radiate the heat and then the exhaust flue here so that's a quick deal there on uh, what my plans are for a, a lot better uh, rocket mass heater um, I should have a lot better burn and a lot better heat exchange with the insulated uh, core. Uh, the only thing I don't know how well it's going to work, the way this firebox is, it comes up the center here, but if you notice here on the back, the exhaust for the center uh, cylinder comes out and then will fill this outer square. So this may be a plus. I may get a lot better heat radiation off of it, um, or it may be uh, worse. I'm not sure. But at any rate, goes through the box and then here's the exhaust that will come out here so I don't know here in the next week or two I'll uh, find some more material get some steel try to get this firebox built and uh, we'll see what happens so that's a quick little video of uh, my plans for my next rocket mass heater thanks for watching remember like comment subscribe 